The OnTrust Vault is a simple, fast way to manage credentials and access from the cloud. As a core feature of privileged remote access, Vault lets you store privileged credentials securely, then use them when accessing endpoints. Here's how it works. Vault is included with privileged remote access, which lets you control, monitor, and manage all the ways privileged users connect to critical endpoints, cloud administrative interfaces, and remote networks. While privileged remote access can connect to external password management solutions, its integrated vault provides fast, essential vaulting capabilities for privileged accounts. In this video, we'll show you vault's password management capabilities, demonstrate enhancements it brings to session management, and then cover what reports are available to support audit and compliance efforts. Vault enables administrators to discover Active Directory and Windows local credentials on a domain and import them for centralized management. To perform credential discovery, administrators select a jump point on the target network and enter a domain administrator account. If desired, you can narrow your search to particular Active Directory organizational units or LDAP queries rather than the entire domain. Once discovered, you can bring these credentials under management with Vault and make them available for use during remote access sessions. You can also manually rotate credentials for those accounts or set them to rotate automatically each time they are used. Because Vault is embedded with privileged remote access, you can run discovery on additional domains wherever you have a jump point installed. In addition to discovering and importing Active Directory and Windows local accounts, you can also use Vault to store generic credentials or SSH keys, and you can give specific privileged users the ability to access them. Once credentials are stored in Vault, you can make them available to be used without ever exposing the credentials themselves. Not only can privileged users check credentials in and out, they can also use BeyondTrust's credential injection capability when accessing endpoints. To show this in action, let's move over to the Advanced Web Access Console. Now, Privileged Remote Access enables privileged users to connect securely with endpoints, databases, network devices, and administrative web consoles. These connections can be centrally managed legacy protocols like RDP, SSH, Telnet, or VNC, or they can be established using BeyondTrust's proprietary connection protocols. For this example, we'll use our WebJump connection method to access an internal portal. WebJump is a great option if you want to manage access to web-based portals like AWS or other IaaS and cloud interfaces. Once a privileged user selects an endpoint, they can see all the credentials available to them on that endpoint. They simply select the credential they want to use and connect. The user can even interact with any additional two-factor authentication methods you may require before accessing the interface. Finally, with Vault, administrators can report on how credentials were used. You can see whenever there was an attempt to use a credential, as well as which credentials those were. You can also search for events involving specific accounts, and you can see every use for these credentials.